Hi, this is John. I want to do a review on my Walmart fold up fork table. I don't really know what it's called. It's over in the uh, uh, saws and hammers and stuff. It's awesome. I hope you look, hope you like it too. Uh, I've had this since last year before they had it. As soon as they had it for like the Christmas special, where not Christmas special, but when they're bringing all their goods in and they had this for sale, but they haven't advertised it yet as a, a special price, whatever. It's 50 bucks at Walmart. It's a fold up sawhorse table. Anyway, let me just show it to you. Okay, there it is. Now, why is this so neat? What makes it so great? It does have clamps to hold everything in place, but you grab it on the sides, and there's two red buttons here. You pull in this, like that. There's a plastic thing down here that you lift up. It has a handle. Fold it to the center. Now it's not going to collapse on you. It holds a thousand pounds. And I'm about a quarter of that, about 240. How do I tell you the truth? I'll cry. <laughs> so, did you guys see me on there? Yeah, you saw me. Okay. Now, what else makes this thing really great? You put your uh, saw and stuff on the shelf down here. Ah, here's the saw. Right there. Before I do that, I pull my clamp out. It comes with two clamps. You know how to use a clamp? You'll be good to go. Has these two slots to fit into? See if I can get myself to do it right. See that. There. Come on. Everything's easy. I just haven't done the clamps in a while. There we go. There's one. There's another one on there, but I wanted to show it to you. I forgot to bring a 2 by 4 Yeah, I got a sheet of plywood here to cut for you. There we go. Isn't that great? <laughs> Clamp it. <laughs> yep. a lot of weight. Very good sturdy balance. Uh, in the center of it has a name brand of K-E-T-E-R. Keter. There we go. It's got two of them. that one right here as well. Can't remember how this. There we go. Oh yeah. <laughs> Isn't that pretty neat, huh? Isn't that cool? Anyway, Pull this out. Put it back. Clamps in place. And I'm trying to get the camera in for you. I mean, for $50, it's a pretty darn good deal. Watch how easy it is to break it down. Okay. Um, the thing is over on this side. I'm going to pull it towards me. Now, on the sides, there's a handle way down here at the bottom. Man, I have to turn my screen around to see if you can see what I'm talking about. There we go. There's a handle here. There's a plastic thing here. It folds in and one over here as well. I just tuck it in a little bit. You don't have to, but it helps get things started. Watch this. Your handle here. And that plastic thing that uh, I pulled out first to fold up the sides. Here it is. Handle like that. Pretty nice, huh? <laughs> Keter. 50 bucks at Walmart. I use this quite a bit. No complaints whatsoever. And what I really liked about it, other than that, of course, here's that plastic thing. Go. What I really like, if I get me two of them, and no one's looking. Oh, I'm done for a while. The boss ain't looking. 
Ah, I can lay here. Oh, I'll take a nap. About a second one, I have my legs up. Oh, the hotel under 50. <laughs> 240, 240. That's what you heard, 240. Uh, anyway. <clears throat> See that? I'm on dirt. This table ain't rocking. Oh, yeah. That was a thousand pounds. <sighs> you put almost anything on here. It has these little slots on here, too. So, you can put your screwdrivers in here to hold them in place. I'm going to do that. Since I'm doing this video, why not? There we go. Camera still going or the battery die? It's still going. I mean, you throw your hammer on your sawhorse. But I got my lever here. I ain't tried putting it in there before, but there we go. Screwdriver here. I can force my hammer through there. Oh, that's right. I got a shelf down below on both sides. <laughs> Pretty nice, isn't it? Very nice. I have no complaints whatsoever. About this thing. Music provided by my wind chimes. If you'd like to buy the CD, only $9.95. Somebody would probably come up with the idea, hey, he's right, I can sell music of wind chimes blowing in the wind. Here's my saw again. I really do need to cut this piece of wood. Yeah. This video ends anytime soon. It's probably because the battery died. Hey, it's still going. Cool. Anyway, I just need a pin, uh, piece one inch wide. So straight edge. It's all set for my 2 by 4 Anyway, I um, always thought if I didn't like this thing for any reason, I'd save my receipt, get my money back from Walmart. I mean, it is just down the road from me. It's not online where it's hard to get your money back. To me, if you got to go online, try to get your money back, they say they're not going to do it right then and there. Unless you send it in, then I'm not really getting my money back because my, my time is money. And they're not paying me for my time. They're just paying me back what I paid in cash. in the airport. Shut it off. <sighs> this is John and Lawrence Hill getting my thumbs up review to this fold up sawhorse work table. They had at Walmart in the year 2013 close to Christmas time. Might have been Thanksgiving. But they did make it a Christmas special price. It's the same price it was when I bought it. It's just they actually advertised it. Um... The only improvements I could see being done to this thing 
is if they had a clamp on work light. Why? I mean, it's just something I thought of. I mean, I'm not going to be out at night work doing this, but uh, really, the only thing that can make this thing better is having two. So you put one board across the other board, and then you can lay down and get some sleep <laughs> in the sun. <laughs> but no, uh, having a second one would be good. But I didn't want to pay 100 bucks for two of them. Why? These. Well, anybody breaking in my shed to get two of these things. These things are nice. Well, they know I got these things. If I got two of them, they're going to break in and get it. They know I only have one. They're like, ain't worth my trouble. Ain't trouble. <laughs> but no, it's awesome. It's, it's really great. Um, the legs are about an inch and a half wide in diameter. Circular legs. And uh, it's all plastic and metal. No wood. Two clamps. And folds up just like that and bring it inside your shed. Put it in the back of your truck or something easily. Well, I hope you enjoyed the video. This is John in Lawrenceville saying good night. <laughs> but no, please, uh, please subscribe if you like any of my videos whatsoever. It doesn't mean you're going to obligate yourself to anything. But YouTube will tell you if I make another video, but that's about it. I'm shooting for a goal with 500,000 uh, 500, subscribers. Now, why is that? Well, if everyone subscribes, then I have a chance to make a little money from YouTube. <laughs> little money. Oh, man. I got a 10.99 from uh, YouTube, Google, in the year 2014. I never heard of a 10.99 before because I didn't do my own business crap, whatever. But my videos are monetized, so, you know, if this or that happens, I might make a little money. Well, over the course of the last year, every few months, every three or four months, I make over $100 on these videos. And they'd send it to me. You know, they deposit my bank. I made like $650 in one year. That, that year, 2013, I made $650. $643, something like that, rounded off. And I'm like, man, if I can get you know, 500,000 subscribers, maybe I can make some more money. <laughs> but no, I really like having everyone come on here and talk. And, you know, whether they say good things or bad things, if they comment, especially about my bed bug videos. I mean, I've had a lot of interaction with people with that. Okay, um, please subscribe and let me know what you think. This is John and Lawrenceville saying goodbye. <laughs>